Hey guys, welcome to my room. Hey guys, come on in. Welcome to my room. <laughs> okay, but in all seriousness, welcome to my room. I'm going to be filming a room tour if you haven't figured that out already. So let's just dive right in. Okay, so when you first walk into my room, you see to the right, you see I have this mess. So I have this New York poster. I got it from, I want to say Bed Bath & Beyond before I moved to New York. And then this, these are my cheer bows from high school. And then this is just has like a bunch of memories in it, some sunglasses, this whole thing. I really hate it, so don't really look at it. But I want to get like some kind of shelving situation, but all on a budget, if you know what I'm saying. Right next to it, I have a, a lamp. <laughs> I'm not using a drill and some cranberry juice because that's normal, right? <laughs> right. starting off well. Alright, so then you go over here and this is my desk. So this is where I get ready. I want to put a mirror up here, but I haven't got to that yet. I just have all my products just kind of spread out in front of me. This denim jacket I like to keep on here because it's cute and it looks nice. Um, I got this chair and desk for Christmas, so I have no idea where I got it, but I got that years ago. Um, I will insert some footage of what my room used to look like before right now because it's really bad. So I just finished unpacking and cleaning and organizing and this is what the room looks like right now. Um, so at least we're clean. And these I'm gonna get rid of at some point. My laundry, my desk, finally someone unpacked. Sorry, I look so bad. Um, my closet, it looks so much better but still like not amazing. Yeah, this is what we are working with right now. Okay, um, we're not going to go in the drawer because it's really messy. But yeah, this is my desk. Um, as you can see, there's a lot of wear and tear on the desk because, like I said before, it's really old. But whatever the... It is what it is. Okay, so coming next to my desk, I just keep some journals and some markers and stuff next to my desk and a few extra hard drives. You know, the usual. I keep my book bag next to my desk too because whenever I go somewhere, this is the bag I usually take. So it's always nice to just keep it handy. Who got that for you? Oh, <laughs> well... Jessica got this, my sister Jessica got this for my sister Ashley when you were in, where, where were you? Turkey. She was in Turkey when she got this, so yeah, and it's mine now, I took it, but the, this is falling off and like, all these like things have fallen off, it's whatever. It's because okay. it's a fake. It's because it's a fake, <laughs> no one has to know that. It's still okay, cute. so then you move over here. Um, this little love sign I got from Party City for like twenty dollars because it's like plastic. It's not very like nice, but it does the job. It's cute, and I wanted one of those really expensive signs, those light up signs, but I didn't want to buy it because it's expensive and this is doing the job. So once this like dies and isn't working anymore, then I'll probably invest in another one, but. Okay, so I just have some trophies over here from when I was competing. I used to have a ton of trophies, but I just threw them all away and I kept like the nicer looking ones. Like this one's from high school, these ones are from dance competitions, and then this one's from my studio for being there for 10 years. Um, I have this candle from Bath & Body Works flannel. It smells really good, it smells like men. Um, just some shells, I have this you are a badass calendar that has like cute little quotes on it every day. It's really nice. I talked about this in one of my other videos before and I really like it. Um, I have this cute little 
thing. I wanted to put this on my desk and put like perfumes in it, but I haven't really got there yet. Right now it just has like a lighter and some matches in it for my candles. And then I have some books and some candy bars that we didn't pass out on Halloween, so I took them just in case I wanted to eat them, you know? I just have them stacked and ready. And the thing is with this, I don't want this. I don't want this. <laughs> <laughs> I've had this since I was like a baby, but I just, it's not broken, it's nice, like it works really well. Um, I'm not going to go in the drawers, like it's just underwears, t-shirts, sports bras and bras and then swimsuits and like dance clothes, but it's, they're not organized, they're really messy. So that's that, but I really want to get a new one of these. So on my shopping list is a new dresser and then some new shelves over there because those are just ratchet and disgusting. Okay, so then coming over here, I have my favorite glass in the world, tumbler cup glass. Um, it says good vibes only. I've taken this everywhere with me. It's been to New York, it's been to Tokyo, and now it's back here. I'm never going to throw this away. It's like cracked and breaking, but I'm never throwing it away. Um, I have this little wood statue thing. I got this when I was in Tokyo. Um, it means luck. Cause I bought it because I was like oh I need all the good luck I can get and then the next week I was in the neck brace so if that explains how my life is going <laughs> can't really say anything else other than that okay I got this lamp I really like it it's from um where's this from Bed Bath & Beyond yeah and then I this is my sister's cork board but I took it and I was gonna make it like a like a dream board but I haven't really made much progress on it all I have is like some Polaroids and then these are two messages that are like pictures that Michael made me so yeah but that's all of this that I like to keep on my bedside table underneath I just have some cords um I haven't really found a nice way to hide those yet I kind of want to get like a little basket under here and just put some like magazines or something but I haven't got that far yet, so I just have this power cord that has all of my cords that I need underneath. So then we move on to my bed. I love my bed. This bed has been in our house for years. Um, I don't know if it's weird, but it used to be my parents' bed, and then my sister's bed, and now it's my bed. Is that weird? I don't know. But, um, so I wanted to go very okay so the thing with my room is it used to be really colorful like you saw before so i wanted to kind of take it to like a grown-up kind of way and do more neutrals and i wanted to do gray and then i did my floor gray and all that so i wanted to do a white comforter and i wanted a white comforter for a really long time but it's really hard to keep it clean so i have to like wash it constantly because i don't want it to like get gross looking I have two blankets on here. I'm not sure where I got this one, but it's the most comfortable blanket in the world, and I love it. Is it yours? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, it's my sister's, but now it's on my bed. And then I got this one from Bed Bath & Beyond as well. So if you're looking for stuff for your room, I would suggest Bed Bath & Beyond because they have real, a lot of really nice things. I just have some stuffed animals on my bed. Uh, this one is from Tokyo when I was the Little Mermaid. And then uh, Michael won me this. Uh, at where did he get me that? I don't know. I, I'm not quite sure. It's not a Kavsky. Could have been a Kavsky. Cedar Point. Oh, he got me it at Cedar Point. And if you guys don't know what Cedar Point is, it's like an amusement park in Sandusky, Ohio, America's Rock and Roller Coast. Right, right on. on. And then Taylor got me this when I was sick. So you know my last vlog, the ER one. She got me this, and it said somebody in I'm not gonna say what city I live in. But Ohio loves you. So, I just thought it was funny. So I put it on my bed. And just have some pillows and stuff. And then I wanted to do gray sheets underneath to kind of match with the whole room. And then I was going to make my bed frame black. I was going to like sand it and spray paint it. But then I decided not to because my trim and my window frames and all of that is the same color brown. So I was like, it kind of ties in. And I don't really want to do everything because that's just a lot. Okay, so coming over here onto my bed, I got some, can you see these? Mm -hmm. I got some uh, art pieces from Society6. I really, really like Society6. If you don't know what it is, this is not sponsored by the way, but 
If you don't know what it is, it's like an online shopping website where you can buy like, um, where artists will put their designs up on the website and then you can turn it into like a pillow or like a pencil case, a book bag, or like you can get them framed or they can just come like this. But I ended up just buying the poster. So this is an art print. These two are the art prints. Woo! And then this is a poster. Um, I got them all in the size large so you can kind of see if this is something you want. It's really big. I didn't think it was going to be this big when I got it, but I really got it. Or I really, I really like it. But um, I bought the frames just from Pacatans because I didn't want to buy it all together because it was kind of expensive. But then buying it separately, I don't know if that was any cheaper. So just do your research on that if this is something you're interested in. But I absolutely love these. And I think they kind of tie my whole room together. I want to get more and do them like all over my room, but we'll just see what happens. I just have these curtains. Um... We got them in New York. Yeah, we got them in New York. They're mine. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, so then my favorite thing in my room is this mirror. Look at it. It's so nice. It's like, as you can see, it's like taller than me. And it's so nice. This can move around. <laughs> like, if you say, I used to have a really crappy mirror in my room. And it was one of those ones that's like kind of bent. So, like, it either made you look like really skinny or like really like lopsided. It was like a fun house mirror. I don't know why I have that. Because it was like $10 at Walmart. So, I'm cheap. But this mirror I wanted to splurge because I know, like, I can take this mirror with me anywhere I go, well, like if I end up getting a house one day or like moving somewhere, I can take this mirror with me. It's super nice. And I got it half off. I didn't even know it was on sale until I was checking out and I was like. Okay, and then um, next to my bed, I just like to keep my purse because I don't know. Okay, so then next is my closet. I don't really want to go in my closet because it's really messy. Like really messy and I just have a lot of clothes, but I guess we'll do it for the sake of the vlog. <laughs> oh my gosh. So this is my kimono I got in Japan because I had to get one because I live there. And then I just have more jackets and stuff over here. My IMG jacket. Um, I got this really nice jacket from Misguided. And then this is what my closet looks like. I obviously need to organize it and go through it, but there is a system. Like there's pants and like leggings and shorts, t-shirts and shirts. And then like these are like my nicer things. <laughs> Clearly I don't take very good care of it. And then all my hoodies and sweaters are up top. This used to be packed all the way up, but I wear a hoodie literally every day. So they're all in the wash. Oh, and I moved all my dirty clothes out of my room so you guys wouldn't see it. Because... You know, you gotta present yourself the best. Okay, so I think that's it for my room tour. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe, like, share, comment down below. Anything you think I should get for my room, decorations, anything else. And I'll try to link most stuff down below if I find it online. If you have any questions, any videos you want to see, leave it down below in the comment section. I would love to do those for you. And thank you. Bye.